Hello kids, Daddy's here. Right now, Daddy will show you a comedy romance film from 2004 titled The Girl Next Door. Be a good kid and subscribe to Daddy's channel. Spoilers ahead, watch out. The film starts with a nerd student named Matthew. Not like another student who have amazing experiences in high school, Matthew spent his high school years as an ordinary student. This was Matthew's senior year. He got the acceptance letter for the Georgetown University. It makes his parents proud of him. However, Matthew was dissatisfied with his life because he had done nothing noteworthy in his life, and he had spent his entire life studying. So Matthew tells his nerd friends Clitz and Eli that from now on, he will be doing something crazy. One night, he sees a hot girl named Danielle. He can't take his eyes from her. Matthew returns to his room and tells Eli about that girl, saying she's incredibly hot, and while he's on the phone, he sees her changing her clothes across the window but she notices him staring at her. She goes to his parents and they call their son. His mom introduces Matthew to Danielle. She didn't tell the parents about him peeking in her room. Danielle house-sitting at her aunt's house, who lives next door. Mom asks Matthew to show Danielle around the block. To be fair, she makes him strip naked in the street. She then takes his underwear and drives away, leaving him naked on the side of the road. She returns minutes later to take him up and tells him that she's just having fun. After that, they go to a restaurant and tell stories about their life. Matthew asks her if she has a boyfriend, she answers no. Danielle realizes that Matthew is single too. They became good friends. The next day at school, Danielle told him to skip the class. He straightly goes to her car and spends the whole day with her. At night, she drives him to an anonymous house. He follows her and suddenly she taking her clothes off and dips into the pool. Matthew joins her, and she asks him what the craziest thing he's done recently is. He says, it's right up here with you. The owner of the house appears just as they're ready to kiss, and it turns out to be Matthew's school principal and they both run away. They go to Eli's house, and Matthew introduces his friends to Danielle. His friends are blown away by how hot she is. The next night, the group heads to a party hosted by a popular student. All the boys are blown away and stare at Danielle. Soon, Matthew kicked out from the party, so that the others can spending a time with Danielle. But he refuses, rushes over to Danielle and kisses her passionately in front of everyone. At school, Eli shows Matthew an adult film featuring Danielle. Matthew is taken aback when he sees his girlfriend in the video. Danielle turns out is a former adult star, which irritates Matthew. Since she's an adult star, Eli suggests Matthew to take her to a motel and bang her. But Matthew decides that he doesn't want to see Danielle again. When he returns home, he sees Danielle talking with his mom. Suddenly he imagines her having an orgasm. Then he shouts and goes to his room. She follows him up and asks him, what happens with you? He looks at the bed and imagines her having sex with him. He decides to take her to a motel tonight. Danielle realizes why she is brought to the motel and starts undressing. She says, I know this is that you want. She realizes that Matthew has figured out that she's an adult star. Danielle then becomes enraged and tells him that she didn't tell him about her past because she liked how he treated her like a normal person not an object. Then she leaves him. One day, he goes to Danielle's house to apologize to her. However, he is surprised to see Kelly, an adult film producer, at Danielle's house. So, Danielle tells Matthew that she will speak with him later and that he should leave. Matthew finds out that Danielle is going to Vegas with Kelly for adult film convention. Matthew tries to stop her, but Danielle says she can't escape her past and must embrace herself as she is. Matthew is saddened by her departure. At night, Matthew gathers his friends and decides to attend the adult film convention in Vegas. When they arrive at the convention, they see Danielle. It shows that her stage name is Athena. Matthew apologizes to her and tells her that she is the best thing that has ever happened to him. Danielle ignores him by getting off from stage. Kelly takes Matthew into a storage room and threatens him to stop filling Danielle's mind with these thoughts, which will ruin Kelly's business. Kelly also asks him to stay away from Danielle. Matthew is not willing to give up and approaches Danielle once again. He tells her that he accepts her for who she is and gives her a drawing that he created especially for her. The next day, Matthew is practicing his speech for the competition in his room. Suddenly, Danielle appears and says that she has left her past for Matthew. She gives him a ride to his school and thanks him for believing in her. He
He asks her to go to the prom with him, and she agrees. Suddenly, Kelly barges into the classroom and drags Matthew outside to his car. He takes him to a private place and informs Matthew that Danielle did not show up on set because of him, and as a result, Kelly has lost $30,000. So, he tells Matthew that he will forget about the money and leave Danielle alone on one condition. Matthew must go to Hugo's house and steal his trophy for Kelly because he took Kelly's ideas. Matthew agrees to steal the award and enters the house, but then Kelly calls the police to report a robbery. Matthew manages to steal the trophy and quickly escapes before the police arrive. The next day, Matthew goes to the bank to withdraw the charity money that he raised for the Cambodian student named Sam Nam to get education in USA. However, he discovers that Kelly has already taken all of his $25,000 and fled. Matthew is taken aback and is unsure what to do next. Matthew goes to Danielle's house and tells her about what happened. Then Danielle has a plan. The next day, they return to Hugo's house and return the trophy to him. Then Matthew tells him about their plan to shoot an adult film in their school. Hugo agrees immediately and he is willing to pay $25,000 to bring Sam Nong to USA. Danielle has even contacted her adult star friends who will be Matthew's prom partners. They all arrive for the prom with swag and style, impressing everyone. Some of Matthew's classmates approach him and inquire whether they are adult stars, to which Matthew responds affirmatively. Matthew then offers them the chance to be in a movie, which they enthusiastically accept. They start filming the adult film in school, but the boys are unable to perform up to the expectation. Klitz offers to help to the scene. For a nerd, he did the scene perfectly. They finish filming without being discovered and celebrate in the limo with champagne. They take everyone home, and when it's Matthew and Danielle only in the limo they kiss and have sex for the first time. The next morning, Eli calls Matthew, panicked, claim the tape is missing. As Matthew walks into his house, he sees Kelly clutching the tape and sitting with the parents and the principal. He blackmails Matthew to pay him half the money that Hugo gave, or else he will show the tape to his family in principle. But Matthew isn't scared of the threat and tells him to go ahead. When Kelly plays the tape, everyone learns that the video is about sex education and does not contain any sex scenes. Matthew had outsmarted everyone by repurposing an adult film as a sex education lesson. Matthew's parents and his principal are impressed by this and praise him for his creativity. The tape is released by Matthew and Hugo, and it becomes an instant hit. Eli has gone a professional director and has his own educational seminars. Klitz, who hid his face while filming, apparently has a monster wiener even he is not a black, that makes him feel proud about himself. Matthew is able to bring the Samnon to the USA. He also can afford his expenses to apply for Georgetown and has the girl next door Danielle always with him. That's all for today kids. Help daddy by like and subscribe. See you on the next videos.